welcome guys uh, today I'm going to show you how you can come with your timetable like this one as you can see here so how do you do this one let us start from the scratch and understand each and everything I am going to delete this one and we start from the scratch so let us start and understand each and everything I have opened a new window as you can see so all you just need to do let's start from here and then all you need you need to click all borders after that match this all of this cell match and center match these two also these two cells match and center you can write here let's say weekly time table here you can write days So you can in, you can put font and you can increase size up to where you want. Same to this one and increase font, line to center, and also you can put it as bold. So all you just need to do also you can now insert the days of the week. Say so here it is Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and also probably if you have up to Sunday, or we don't need this Sunday, we can remove this one, we can remove this cell. So align them center. And another thing that I would like to do also you need to highlight all these cells come to format format row and size put to 25 and also these cells all of them match them and uh, text wrap so you can come here okay Wait, before we don't need to text wrap, we need to match them. You need to match all these cells. You need to text wrap, I mean, all of this. And you can increase their size. After that, you click one two three all these cells match them and text wrap again here all of them you can match and also text wrap after that here we can write a break break for 20 minutes then all you need is to do is put it at the center and then the text rotate it upwards and put into bold and increase the font size up to where you want here we can put lunch after that we can rotate you can put it to center rotate the text up Put into bold increase the font size up to the one that you want also this cell you can format row and height to 25 so that everything should be uniform after that all you just need to do let's say for example we insert here now our time we can start from 8 40 a.m. 920 
So I'm just going to insert all this. So after this, when you have done like this, all you just need, you need to copy to these other cells. And you edit them later. You just need to copy. And you will edit them later. Here you can put subject, let's say for example, mathematics. Next can be Kiswahili, English, computer, physics, history, biology, and then chemistry. This is just an example. After that, you can increase this font size. You can start changing time, so 840 to 920. So this is 920. You can continue increasing. This is 10 from 10 a.m. to 10 40. Next from 11. Eleven forty. Eleven forty. Twelve twenty. So on, so on. We can put here from two. Again, p.m. Then from two forty p.m. Probably three twenty p.m. and so on. So this is how you can. Uh, make your timetable in Excel so you can I don't need to fill these others because I know if I have shown you the first one you can fill the rest of it so this is how you can create an interactive timetable in Excel so thank you so much